Nobody believed that this would happen, that this day would come, and the day is here! Hey everybody, I'm Kelsey. I'm single, so we thought it would be funny two years and three months ago to start a 100 baby challenge. It's a challenge in The Sims 4 where you have one matriarch and they are supposed to have 100 children all with different partners. There's a lot of rules to this challenge. If you're interested in starting your very own, that link as always will be below. Today is our final day. We will be having our final baby in the challenge. We're gonna have a great goodbye party. To me, essentially, those the impeachment mates will still be online if you want to play with them yourself, you can download them on this link below. It's going to be, ha. Ah, if you just look us up in the gallery, you can download all the impeachment Maze for yourself. Yeah, so my goal today, have an awesome party, get pregnant with our last baby, have our last baby. I guess we'll reveal our final baby name and that'll be it. So make sure to stay to the end. I have a lot of exciting things to talk about at the end and uh, I prepared a lot of fun stuff. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. Let's get into the video. Let's hang out with the impeachment Maze. We are back with the impeachment Maze family. Kelly is sitting outside. We got Tom here with, honestly, those pants look concerning. Like, did you murder someone in those pants? Why are the pants looking like that? Tom, I thought we dressed you better than that. Kara's upstairs needing a lot. Everyone's pretty needy right now. It needs a lot of stuff. It's 10 p.m. We could get pregnant like right now, but let's take it easy. We've rushed the whole challenge. So let's let's have Kelly have a moment to herself. She's gonna go to bed. Athena is being such a good girl, doing her homework. She needs to get a skill up to level three and her only skill right now is video games. She's a geek. I feel like gaming makes sense because she's a geek, so she, she can keep that. Josh, how are you doing? Josh is doing great. It's a Friday. So we got class in three days. Josh is great. Everyone's just doing okay. And our Kelly is sleeping. She's slumbering in her bed. Oh my gosh, you can just see the graves out behind her room. What of you? I don't know if I love this for her. That's like, <laughs> what was I thinking? <laughs> oh my gosh, smelly baby. Mom has the super efficient baby care that she needs to get this done. Also, she got a new birth, birth certificate. <gasps> I came back to it in the end. I came around to it. It was frustrating for like most of the season and now it's great. 99 birth certificates. Whew, that is bananas. That is so crazy. Oh my gosh. I turned away and Kelly's being the best mom ever and teaching Zuko some stuff. What are you guessing? Oh, it's a bottle. Can you say bottle? No, that's bed. Kelly's playing with Josh now. She's being such a good mom today. Kelly's really grown up. It's New Year's Eve. Oh my gosh. It's the start of a new year in my Sims lives. Well, it's a Saturday. It's 8.30 a.m. So where, what should they do? Where should they go? You know, we've gone on Impeachish May family vacations before and we've had babies and stuff. So let's go manage the world. We're gonna pick out a place and deck it out for toddlers. That way we don't get messed up. It's snowy right now, so maybe we'll go on vacation to maybe Sulani could be nice. We'll make a little Sulani vacation home. All right, let's see if this is the right place for us. It's a little chieftain home. Oh, wow. Oh, it's so tropical. Okay, this is clearly not enough room for all of my kids. But what if I made this room bigger and that we just make it all as big as possible? Great. And then we take this and we just make a ton of beds. So we'll put a little toddler bed in here. That's for Zuko. So all the kids can sleep in the same room together, essentially. That's cute. Okay, great. So this is the kids' room. This is where we'll be. And then we need like maybe a toddler potty in the bathroom over here, right next to the, the big potty. It'll be in like a nice color that matches things. Ooh, very nice. I think this should be okay. So now we can go on a vacation. Peach Schmee family vacation strikes again. This is perfect. It's 300 a day. So we'll only probably stay like one or two days. So let's take a vacation. Listen, okay, I want to have on my vacation Whitney Miller come. I know that means that one of my Peaches Made children might not be able to come, and I'm sorry about that. I think maybe maybe our eldest won't come. You know what, maybe I sh it's time to move Tom out. Tom, thank you so much for being my last adult in the house. I mean, besides obviously like Kara and Athena who will, will be taking over, but thank you for being the last adult in the house to make sure that everything ran smoothly, Tom. And you're definitely gonna share your love with animals to the world and be that loner recycling man. I know you are. You're gonna find love out there, Tom. Tom, go move in with Timmy, your twin brother. We now officially have 
a space in the home and that we don't have to leave anyone behind. I love that we move out a sim to take a vacation so we can invite our girlfriend to our vacation. Or well, she's not our girlfriend yet. All right, so Athena's coming. We're gonna invite Whitney. Kara is coming. Josh and Jaden. Zuko can come and that's it. Okay, great. We have them all. We're gonna go to Sulani, take a lovely vacation to the Chieftain's Villa, which I outfitted hopefully enough for the family. We're gonna rent for two days? YOLO. This is the weekend and it's New Year's. They're gonna have a great time. Okay, great. A nanny bee will be taking care of William. So William's gonna be good while we're away. Look at us! Oh my gosh, and girlfriend, give her residence keys. Be like, they're not even dating. And she's like, do you want the keys to my home just in case? They're deep in love. Oh my gosh, she wasn't even surprised. Whitney was like, okay, yeah, it makes sense. She's the neighbor. Go play in the sand, Zuko. That'll be fun for Zuko. Look at vacation mode, Zuko. Zuko is playing with the chickens. This is so cute. Oh my gosh, all the chickens are walking through Zuko. I am concerned. Whoa, why don't, why don't you woohoo with Whitney a little bit? Have some vacation fun. Kelly's asking her over here if she wants to go woohoo. And she said, yes. <gasps> Oh my gosh, I wonder if there's, this is their first woohoo or not. I think it might be their first time woohooing on vacation together. It's romantic. They got a room together. They can look out the windows over here and some like ruins and stuff. This is so romantic. <gasps> Okay, we'll leave you to it. We're gonna go watch Zuko be cute. They're in the bedroom. Meanwhile, Zuko's just being adorable with the chickens. What, are you having a cocktail, Kara? I hope that's a mocktail. You better hope that's a mocktail, Kara. You are a teenager. That is not allowed, not in my household. Oh, Jaden's talking with Whitney. Oh my gosh, let's be a fly on this wall. Ooh, it looks like we're looking through a, a window. It's kind of creepy. Oh my gosh, she's such a good mom. Look at the face she's making when she's looking at him. She kind of is like looking very maternal to him. Okay, she's leaving now and he can go to the bathroom. She's enjoying the view. She's so happy. Look at her. Wow, she already feels like part of the family. So I've put it off long enough. I think it's finally time for Kelly to ask Whitney a very special question. Okay, going out there, girly. Actually, you know what? Can you change your outfit for me? I want you to match me. Let's match. Change it. <gasps> Whoa, she's asking her if she will be her girlfriend and she says, yes, well, my kid is making a mess. No, I was gonna do something very romantic, but I gotta, I gotta take care of this. We firmly express disappointment. We just asked her to be our girlfriend. Whitney said yes, which was exciting, but now we gotta discipline my kid because, oh my gosh, like, Jaden, you distracted me, you little monster. <gasps> This is so cool though. We can commune with spirits. I mean, we should. We should commune with some spirits. Commune with the spirits, Kelly. Wow. Oh, are they wrapping around her? What's happening? <gasps> wow, this is so spooky and cool. All right, but I think you need to try for a baby. I think it's time. She's your girlfriend. You've made a commitment before you even had the baby, which is crazy for Kelly. That is a bold move. And she's gonna ask her, will you be the hundredth baby mama of this challenge? And she said, yes! And they're gonna go have a baby together. Oh my gosh, how cute is this? And they're gonna have spirits blessing this union. I don't know why, it's a little weird, but here we go. Okay, and we'll let them alone for the last time. Ooh, they can all go swimming. Oh my gosh, they all have to go swimming later once we find out if she's pregnant. All right, take a pregnancy test, Kelly. Wow, this is like the smoothest that a vacation has ever gone in this in this game. I wanna go on this vacation. I'm living vicariously through her. <gasps> yes! Oh my gosh, we're pregnant with the 100th baby and we totally emotionally scarred Josh and Peter Schmay in the process. He caught his mom peeing, but it's okay. Oh my gosh, Kelly, go tell your girlfriend. Go tell Whitney, go tell Whitney. Kelly and Whitney, what would really their ship name? Welly. Welly! Oh my gosh, Welly. Oh my gosh, they're so excited. Marry me now. Marry me now, Whitney. Oh no, she's cooking. <gasps> Double marry me now, Whitney. <laughs> Whitney is the perfect woman. Look at her. Oh, she's gonna go to sleep. She's gonna take a little disco nap. It's 5 p.m. Oh my gosh, but look at Jaden. Jaden's in full vacay mode. Who gave you permission? Literally no one. He's gonna go swimming on his own. You better, you better not. If you get some risky business, I don't know. You know what? Your energy's a little low. I can't do, I can't risk this. I can't risk this. I'm sorry, buddy. Why don't you go to sleep and then tomorrow we'll all go swimming, okay? I just can't, I just can't. I can't handle another water-related debt. We had one in a bathroom and one in a pool, and I can't do it again. 
Aw, they're in such a honeymoon phase. <gasps> oh, they're cheering to New Year's. New Year, new baby, new relationship. God, this is Kelly's first relationship too. Blow horns. They're having such a nice little moment. Yay! Wait, literally, who is? who are you? Who is this man that just walked into our rental home and took out the trash? I mean, oh, maybe he works here. We're gonna assume he works here. Maybe it's his house, he's renting it out and he likes to keep it clean. I'm a little nervous about all of this situation. McKinley House, I don't think we need you here, McKinley. I'm sorry. I don't, I don't think we need you on our vacation, you weird woman who just walked into our home and is just sitting here. Okay, bye, please leave, thank you. Annabella Doyle, who the flip is that? Why are all these people coming into our home? This is creepy. What is this? This is like a creepy film. What are they all walking in here? Get out. Get out of my house with my kids. She's sleeping in our bed and so is he. What the heck? Did they rent out this place to multiple people at once? What is the deal? And we can't even see where my girlfriend went. <gasps> Wait, there she is. She's swimming. She's having a nice swim. I hope she takes care of herself. I don't want her to like, whoa, she gonna go snorkeling. Good for you, girl. Have fun. She's enjoying her vacation. <gasps> Look at, Kara just took himself on a swim. Well, I think it's time for us all to swim. Let's swim all together. Swimming time. Why are you so sad? It's swimming time. Okay, I need some happy faces here. We're at the beach. Look around. This is the most beautiful view I think I've ever seen. Athena's done it. Athena's going swimming. Not a stress in sight. Everything going smoothly. She's a speedy swimmer. Look at her go. Whoop, she just ran right into her girlfriend. Let's splash Athena. Let's have fun with our, our daughter who used to hate us. It'll be good. There it is. And then pee in the ocean. Cause why not? We're on vacation, baby. Okay, she just went, ah! She just went in the ocean and Athena's just sitting here like, yeah, okay. How's the snorkeling going, boys? Oh yeah, he's seeing them fishies. Look at him go. This woman's on a boat gonna run down my children. Be careful! Hey, be careful, lady. My kid's there. <gasps> She's run over him like three times. Look out for Josh. Let's all, let's cook a gourmet meal for everybody since we can. Prosciutto wrapped asparagus, uh, herb crust salmon, salt and pepper shrimp cocktail. That does sound really good. A tofu stir fry or a chicken stir fry. Let's do a chicken stir fry for the whole family. Kelly, why don't you go cook lunch for everybody? And then everyone's gonna have lunch together. Isn't that gonna be nice? Running home, they're all running home. Everybody's safe, all my ducklings are safe. And meanwhile, oh, look at her. Doing her little choppy chop, making some lunch for everyone. Everyone come eat, please. Thank you, kids. Athena's decided to eat popcorn instead. Josh is also eating something random. Jaden's gonna come eat it. Oh, she's having some of the stir fry. I love that they're all having the stir fry together. Ugh, oh, that makes me wanna stir fry. Oh no, I knew something wrong would happen. There's no bathtub so I can't wash Zuko. He's all stinky and we can't give him a bath. It's okay, you know what? Maybe it is time to head home after Zuko finishes eating. We'll, might, we'll maybe call this vacation an excellent one. We don't need to sleep here again. So let's end the vacation here and go home. I think it's been good, but I want them to all get like a good night's sleep before school tomorrow. I don't want to miss school. So we're all going to go home. And now it's time to go back to Del Sol Valley, back to reality and, you know, get everybody as aged up as possible. There we go. Now we can have one of our, our kids give uh, Zuko a bath. We're going to have Kara gives Zuko a bath because Kara's a good boy. She's celebrating an excellent vacation. Honestly, best family vacation I think we've ever had. It almost was perfect until my baby needed to be washed. <gasps> It's our twin brother, Wesley, came up. Our ghost twin brother. Oh, he's gonna feel the baby. This is the hundredth baby, Wesley. Aww, that was very sweet. They've been together since the beginning. They were, they were womb mates. Oh, we only got nine more hours until she's in trimester three. So we're gonna have to get ready the party, which means, wait, Athena, go to school. Why are you, are you going to high school? Are you all going to school? Okay, they're all going to school. I'm gonna have you all study hard, study hard. I think this might be our last day at school together. Okay, well, since everyone's gone at school and our sweet baby angel Zuko is asleep and Kelly is in the best mood ever, I 
think we've got some new neighbors. I want to visit some new neighbors of ours that have maybe moved in recently off camera. Oh my god, wait, it is the blank house. I thought there was a house there. Oh well, it's okay, look. Oh my gosh. <laughs> And they're all dying at the same time in unison because of the disgusting air. Oh my gosh. I re-downloaded all of our original friends. Oh my gosh, is she cross-eyed? Are you okay, girl? Hazel, are you okay? Uh, I re-downloaded all of my original babies and I'm gonna make best friends with all of them. Technically, they're not related anymore because the real ones have died. It's the alternate universe. You get the whole thing. But anyway, they're back. Of course, let's first start our true for introductions with Olive, our very first BB girl. Olive is a back baby. She is thriving. She's got the bun. She's got the kind of mean face that we love. Oh my God, she's so beautiful still. Why are all my Sims looking cross-eyed? Are they okay? Oh my God, are they okay? What the flip is wrong with my family? Oh, Charlie. Let's say hi to Charlie. These are our great uncles and aunts of Kelly's, I think. Jamie's here, Renee, Charlie. We got Hazel and Brielle are having a fight for some reason. We gotta meet Brielle, the OG klepto. Look at all of these lovely, lovely people that we're gonna have to invite over to our party to celebrate the 100th baby. Look at her, she's laughing with all of them. All right, well, why don't we all go back to my house? We'll invite you all over later, okay? When I'm having the party. I will admit, like, this is the most deeply connected to Sims I think I've ever been because I've played with the same family for two years. I don't think I've ever done that before. I normally get bored of the family after, like, a month. <laughs> Winnie wants to go on a date? Why don't you go use the toilet really fast? Can she not go in these bathrooms? I don't understand. Can you go in here at all? No! She's having a bathroom accident in front of everybody! No! Not on the day! Oh my gosh. Will Whitney still love us if we're disgusting? Girl, she smells. Can you like go upstairs and wash your hands? She can't. Why can't she go there? Can she go upstairs at all? Well, okay, listen. This is gonna be weird, but guys, just trust me on this, all right? What I'm gonna do, is there like a pop-up shower? <laughs> like an outdoor little shower, you know? How would they know? No one needs to know. Go take a shower really fast, <laughs> Kelly. All right, there she goes. She's gonna get, take a little shower really fast before a date. Hopefully Whitney still loves her. Why don't we share some insecurities afterwards? <gasps> and she still accepted her! Oh my gosh. Express some fondness for her. She is so embarrassed. She reassured her. That's so cute. Oh, Athena's an A student. Ath Athena was much smarter in school than Kara, and I'm not that surprised. The date is over because we took too long because we peed ourselves. However, can we go here together? All right, let's get them to go over there. We're gonna have her change outfits. I want her to change into her fancy formal wear. Can we even propose yet? She's technically still the matriarch. I don't know if we can propose yet. All right, she's gonna go home. I was thinking about having her propose, but I was like nervous because like, I don't think she's allowed to be married to anyone, but I, I think it'd be okay to have a fiance. You know, she meant to propose and she peed herself and everything was awkward and everything was wrong. So it wasn't the time. Okay, we need to age up Athena too. Athena can be an adult now. Happy birthday, Athena. Blow out the kids. You did it! She aged up and now she's creative too! She gained the last part of her personality because that's how this works. All right, she seems in a pretty dang good mood. So let's throw a flippin' social event. Let's do a house party. And then the other guests, Ryder, Whitney, Casey, Ruth, Brielle, Olive, Chelsea Jr., Belle, Charlie, August, Tom Holland, maybe Alexis, Timmy, Holden. Let's invite Todd. All right, entertainer. <laughs> Ekram's gonna be the entertainer. Mixologist, we'll hire one, I guess. No big deal. We're hiring everything. It's gonna be the works. We're gonna have it at the 100 Baby Warehouse. Let's quickly decorate. I think it should be happening in the backyard. So we're gonna put this over here. We're gonna delete this like DIY flooring and basketball court. And we're gonna put a dance floor. I want a nice DJ booth and it's gonna be right here. And we're gonna actually like hire a DJ headliner for it. <laughs> for fun, we're gonna do it. We'll bring the bar outside for now because we want it all happening outdoors. House party, baby, let's go. Come on over, babes. 
Todd is the first one to arrive for the 100 baby party. Ekram's here. Oh my gosh, Zuko, you're level three of potty. Good job, buddy. All you gotta do is work on thinking next and you're done. Then you can join the party or just go to bed. I don't care. Where's the rest of our party people? There we go. Here we go. Thank for coming. Who's this? It's Charlie. Thank Charlie for coming. It's Tom Holland. Holden, we got riders here. Oh my gosh. Thank you all for coming. Oh, Whitney. Whoa, she's in her pop star outfit, apparently. Maybe we're missing the pants to this. Oh my gosh, Ruth is meeting Olive. Oh my God, is this the best moment of my life? It certainly is. William just aged up. Oh my gosh, it's also William's birthday, apparently. Everyone's here to celebrate. Oh, so cute. He's ready to party and he's fussy. Oh no. Let's turn on some electronica and I just want everybody to dance. I want everyone outside. Come on, Zuko. Yes! Zuko, good job, happy birthday! We're gonna age up Zuko too. The whole family's here to be aging up Zuko. Kelly, let's get the party started outside. Let's go. Come on everybody, get outside. Don't be inside, stay outside. Come with the party girl. Everybody's going outside, that's good, that's good, that's good. Everyone's dancing. I want it to be a party, I want it to be a rager. Look at, she's doing it, Charlie's impressed. Olives is having some good dance vibes. Everyone's dancing. Did Zuko finally age up? There we go, Zuko. Okay, <laughs> there's too much going on. Zuko is a geek and pick a number one through four. It's three. Zuko is a rambunctious scamp. Look at Zuko. Zuko's got a new hairstyle. And Zuko, your first order of business as a kid is to clean up your own mess that you made as a baby. Oh no, she's tired. No, she's gonna go to bed during her own party. Well, let's hang out with the other impeachment schmays. Oh my God, they're all asleep. Ekram's all alone upstairs. He's like, I'm gonna entertain from up here. What a weirdo. It's like the house is like alive again with all of our family and the matriarch a little too tired for the party, always passing out as usual. The babies are empty, it's ready for the final baby to arrive. So cool to see like my favorites of like their most recent generation with like the first generation all hanging out in one place. Casey never came over. We gotta call Casey and have her come over. I feel like I want our mom to come over. Casey's sleeping, dang it Casey! Fine, we'll get you to come over tomorrow in the morning. And they're all saying they gotta see each other the party's over, everyone's out, they've had their cake, and now it's time for all my kids to go to- Get out of here! Please leave, Ekram. <laughs> Last person still awake is Josh. Our he DJ headliner that we paid for never showed up, but that's okay. The party's over. It was a good one, it was cool to see everybody together. <gasps> Oh no, Landgrab Power shut off our power because we forgot to pay the bills. I thought we were on top of this. Kelly, what have you done? She really needs to go to the bathroom too and all the kids are going to school. We got our power back on, which is really good. I'm happy that we got the land grabs to get off our back. You know who should invite over to hang out right now? We're gonna invite over our mom. I'm gonna invite over Casey. Casey weirdly reminds me of my mom because my mom's also very athletic. My mom's not a glutton though, but she does love some good food. Oh, here she is. Give her residence keys. And then I want you to give her the big news that this is the final baby. You're pregnant with the last baby of the 100 baby challenge. She's like, mom, it's the final baby. Do you wanna, do you wanna try to touch it? And she's like, wow, I can't believe it. I'm so happy we moved out Casey before she died so that we can, we can have her be a part of this moment. Oh, they got a sentiment. You know what? It's been wonderful to spend time with you. We've made some great memories and we'll make many more. I'm sure of it. Oh, why don't you go visit everybody's graves a little bit? Let's strengthen the physical connection of Wesley. Let's have a moment with our fallen Sims on the day of the birth of our final baby. There you go. Oof. Wesley's like, I'm here. <gasps> Kelly's gone into labor. Oh my gosh, it's happening. Holy nuggets. Okay, okay, let's stop everything. We have to go to the hospital because we need the final baby birth certificate and we don't get a birth certificate if she has the baby here. So we're going to the hospital. It's happening. Oh my gosh, I'm not ready. I'm both ready and not ready. I've been waiting obviously all this episode for it, but also I don't I don't know how to function anymore. I'm very excited and very scared. <laughs> All right, we have to steal our, our final chair. Oh wait, no one's inside. <gasps> we can steal this. Go steal that, no one's inside yet. Don't let Theo Beckett catch you. He's like, hey, that's my best friend. I'm like, oh my gosh, Alex, don't you dare catch her. Don't you dare catch her. Boom, that was 
tight and then just sit on this one like what wasn't there only oh ever one couch here i don't know okay oh my gosh she's in the hospital gown for the last time here she goes marching right to the machine my heart is like fluttering i'm like so i'm like scared i'm like nervous but we've done this a hundred times. He's like, are you, are you ready? She's like, I guess I'm ready to have the hundredth baby in this challenge. Like literally most of my, a lot of my career, half my career has led up to this moment. <laughs> it's a, it's a girl. Oh my gosh, I, I don't know why I'm crying. It's not a real baby. It's a girl. Okay, well, I'm gonna look up for the last time the final baby name. All right, so I found this. It says, Epic Fangirl says, Kelsey should name the final baby boy or girl Kelsey. That way she comes full circle. And I couldn't think of a better ending. Final baby in the challenge is Kelsey and Future Shmay. <laughs> Welcome to the family, Kelsey. Oh my gosh, Kelsey and Whitney had a baby. Kelsey and Peach Shmay, a baby girl. Oh my gosh, we had it. We had our hundredth baby. Oh my god. Yeah! Oh my god. We did it. We did it. Oh my gosh, I got a party hat. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, happy 100th baby, everybody. There's streamers. There's balloons. I can't believe it. <gasps> oh my gosh, we did it. I did it. No one expected we'd be here. Wow, and we're back home. And here's sweet baby Kelsey, our 100th baby and our 100th baby birth certificate. And we'll put that up on the wall. We did it. I actually did finish the 100 baby birth certificate wall too, because like I wasn't expecting that either. There they are, 100 baby birth certificates in our 100th baby. Sweet baby Angel Kelsey. Wow, guys, it feels like it was only yesterday when I was starting off this challenge. Move to Del Sol Valley, just a girl and her dream. To have a lovely family, a kid or two, it seemed. But then something compelled me to have a couple more. So I had a hundred babies, I had a hundred babies and Sims more. First came baby Olive, and though she looked quite mean, the sweetest baby Angel, that I had ever seen. But then the kids kept coming. There were three, then six, then more. Turns out we were headed for full-blown Todd McGill. Along came Greg, a beautiful dream daddy for this impeachment May. And later on came Ryder, the nerdy boy next door. Grew up to be so handsome, romantic and self-assured. All in Sims 4. children to create had to date so many men I struck out with the Latin but I scored with Spider-Man Tom Holland at first I
saying goodbye My babies flew the nest Now the matriarch can rest And now I'm saying goodbye Kelly, Casey, Chelsea All 100 babies Thank you for the memories challenge now is through when you think of me i hope it turns your plum bobs green i'll keep you in my heart forever more i had a hundred babies who i loved and adored I had a hundred babies in Sims 4. Well guys, we had a good run. This was honestly the highest point of my career thus far. And it's hard to imagine what possibly could top it. I also have a very special personal announcement at the end of this video, and that is that um, this is my last video as a full-time employee at BuzzFeed. It's been the greatest gift to make this content with such wonderful people here at the channel. And I'm so excited and happy to announce that uh, I will be spreading my wings and flying as my own own, um, independent creator so if you would like to follow me on that journey it is going to be both scary and exciting and I'm so thankful to have the support of the BuzzFeed team behind me as I make this transition you guys can check me out on my youtube channel youtube.com slash Kelsey Dangerous where we'll be doing plenty of fun shenanigans uh, in the sims and elsewhere thank you guys all for the memories thank you so much I really do Hope that whenever you think of me, it turns your plum bob green, but also don't be a stranger. Make sure to go follow me on all my social media and I know we will see each other around the internet very soon. And uh, I guess for the last time, hey guys, I'm Kelsey <laughs> and I'm single. So we thought it would be funny if I tried the 100 baby challenge. It's a challenge in The Sims 4 where you have one matriarch and they're supposed to have 100 children, all with different partners. <laughs> and now, I have completed the challenge, and I've had 100 babies in The Sims 4. Bye! Hey everybody, thank you so much for watching the 100 Baby Challenge. If you're interested, make sure to hit that subscribe button, leave a like, or check out some of our other videos.